Hello everybody, welcome back to more Ziggurat 2. Interesting thing, uh, there's been a couple updates. In fact, there's, I think there's been two updates <laughs> since the last episode, technically. Uh, dealing with a couple balanced things, and they... Uh, interesting thing, they changed the difficulty. They made Apprentice harder and Scholar easier. So... That may potentially help us out with some of the problems we're facing. We're going to keep it on Apprentice and see how much harder it is before... I mean, we could obviously, of course, change it to the harder difficulty and then go back. But I don't know. I think I'm, I'm going to leave it like this. Let's just see what the heck happens here. Uh, they also made it so when you get the map piece, you will actually... Or no, not the map piece. When you go to the final location, it'll tell you what you're going to get. Uh, all kinds of various UI clarity things as well. Uh, yeah, we're definitely gonna... We're gonna go get this one done here first. And I think I'd like to... So, hold on. Do they, does everything start at level 0? It starts at level 1, doesn't it? Amulet of Infinity. Unlimited mana for some time. I, you know, I like that. I like that a lot. Uh, that combined with Jacob could be pretty, pretty wild. Dragon Bile, Poisonous Breath. Oh, I remember that. You know what? Let's just take everything here. Let's take all of that. We'll start the quest with Jacob. I'm a little concerned since he's slightly underleveled compared to Argo. But we're going to pop on in here. Pop on in. And see what this new, uh, the new difficulty looks like. Since it's apparently, yeah, apparently slightly, slightly harder. Got Dragon's Buy, which I I imagine is like it was in the first game, which is kind of like a flamethrower, but poison though. Yeah, it, it seems like it's um it's less close range than the other one that I remember. It seems it seems good. Right click, is it potentially still the uh, lava ball of poison? Yep. And there is indeed a poison effect going on too. This seems really good. If we could just, uh, if we get, got it guaranteed, I, maybe the thing is that it just drains your mana like crazy. Which, if that's the case, getting all the stuff that we got right now is very much going to be a, a good idea to have with this weapon. Because look at this, unlimited mana, we just literally get to hold down fire. And also our ability as this character does kind of the same thing. We get increased damage uh, for infinite mana too. Penalty just being that we would take uh, five damage. I mean, yeah, right? Why not? Barrier, I, I don't know. I'm like, I'm pretty neutral on barrier at the current state. Like, I like it. I like it. It's fine. I wouldn't say it's bad. But I don't know. Is it worth a pickup? In longer runs, probably not. Also, yeah, that's what I was about to say. There's a new enemy as well. They added a new enemy to the game already. There's already been, I want to say, if you are one of the people who has, like, negative or middling opinions of the game, I don't, I have not actually seen negative opinions of the game, but uh, middling opinions, if you're one of the, the, the few people I've seen like that, uh, know that there's been four actually substantial updates to the game already. Actually substantial already. Yeah, see, our barrier's already almost gone. And here's the issue with barrier, especially early on. Whoa, boy. Especially early on is the fact that uh, most of the game, like, you take a lot of chip damage in this game. And you slowly heal, you, like, you just slowly heal it back through either level ups or whatever the hell, you know, fill in the blank. So, something like Barrier is really susceptible to chip damage, and it makes it so all of those health drops that we just saw there, they don't matter. Okay, I mean, these guys have got to be immune to poison. Or at the very least, take less poison damage. Okay. Yeah, yeah, dead. Okay, I... Their, uh, their attack arc seems a little bit more understandable to me today. I don't know why. Oh, hey, I didn't even see that, boy. Rip. Get out of here. That is some damage, man. That is a, it's a very strong spell. Gotta be careful. They will heal themselves the hell up. I'm curious. 
Yeah. Yeah. Nope. Definitely immune to poison. Very large. Oh, jeez. Why give these guys healing? Why give them healing? My mana is so bad that I couldn't even... Oh, jeez, that's a... Here's the thing. Imagine that, but with the enemy having two times the amount of HP. We maybe could have been in an unkillable situation. <laughs> Gonna go with rewards. If we can sneak out, like, a, a big old batch of coins from this very small level, I think that'd be really slick. I would dig that a lot. Please, no poison immune, boys! You definitely don't see poison immune. Yeah, I just realized. You might be. You are not? Oh, okay. I would have figured that uh, Earth Boy would have not been poison immune. Or would have been poison immune. Let's get all that. And you know what? Let's get it. Ah, you do have to be like kind of close. That's the that's the penalty there. We took a we took a big old slap to the face. Unless this uh, ability does more than five, they could have changed it. Eleven, fine. <laughs> Ah, shoot. <laughs> All right. Well, any uh, any knowledge of difficulty, balance, out the window for today, or at least for this first run here. We cannot take any of this info as fact. Okay. That went well. Hey. My God. How was I supposed to dodge that one? All right. Well, I'm uh, I'm in a little bit of peril. Just an itty bitty uh, little batch of peril. Just a tiny bit. But, you know, we die, we die. Ooh, boy, oh. Ice boy, you know. I would say maybe second second scariest of the of the crew. You know him well. I love that. Give me that AoE. Don't care about it. Oh. What? Run through. That AoE could happen, though. We have to be careful. Oh, boy. I'm trying to run in a little bit of a circle. Get uh, all of them poisoned. This is all free right now. Oh my god. Really? What? That one hit me? There's some stuff that I just do not quite get how it is particularly hitting me, but you know, I'll trust you. That attack is terrifying. With how low the dodge is, you know, or how low, or how long the cooldown is, some of those attacks are super close together. I know that that's a maybe a silly thing, but it seems like we maybe will be getting more potions too, right? If we're getting more potions, it's not silly at all. This was a one length, but maybe, I don't know. Yeah, I was going to say. One length does not mean one floor. One length means one or two floors. Blop. Good. Don't have a staff. I'll take that. Oh, boy. Okay, pretty tight quarters. What do we got? Oh. What the hell? The damage is so much higher. Why did it... What? Did they change him? Did they nerf this character? Am I... Were we not at full health? Were we not at full health? We, we must not have been at full health, right? 
I thought we were, but I guess I'm totally off base. Otherwise, that wouldn't make sense, right? They wouldn't hit. They wouldn't nerve him that hard. And I missed the change. I don't think. Well. I do hear that. Oh, what the heck? That's mean. Spike traps. Whoop. Okay. I'm curious. I'm tempted to do our ability again, even though it got me in a lot of trouble there. Oh, did I hit there? I don't think I did. Oh, boy. Big radius there. Big radius. Hasty. Good. Poisoned and... Ooh, frozen. Don't mind if I do. Walk on through. Are we missing a lot of experience gems or something? I feel like we're leveling a little slower. Hmm. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Boom! Yeah, this always does a ridiculous amount of damage. It is upgraded quite a bit as well, which is very much worth keeping in mind. <laughs> Oof! <laughs> Just get it. This is a farming run. This is a farming run. This is a. Uh, what was I, gonna say? I was going to say artificer, but I, it's not what they're called, is it? What are they called? In uh, Darkest Dungeon. Oh my god, why can't I think of the name? They're basically just used for farming farming runs. I can't think of them right now. It's not an artificer. Or it, or it is, and I'm totally double wrong. Thought it started with an O. Not an occultist. Nope. Oh well. Or I, I don't. I, it's gonna drive me crazy. Oh my god. Nope. We're gonna. Oh, I thought we were gonna get hit there for sure. All right. That's pretty. That's a pretty slick one. Oh, they changed that too, so you can actually look at it before. Oh, we have to do it legit backwards. Okay. Okay. That, that's a pretty cool one. I I, I I can respect it. Little itty bitty maze where you gotta move fast. But yeah, they changed the perk drops on the ground so that you actually get to look at them. They apparently made it so, yeah, in the UI when you upgrade a certain weapon, it'll actually legitimately tell you which one's been powered up, which is a, a clarity issue that I definitely definitely mentioned they've apparently changed these so that uh, oh, when monsters die they don't come back quite as fast which I would say is a great change because I've definitely had some of these where it's uh, it's been felt very silly to even bother attacking the enemies getting that HP back there <laughs> that was a fadeaway right there. Wow, we I can't we can actually hit from there. That's nuts. See, this is like a gross little spot there. That I mean, using a nice move on Ice Boy seems like a bad call. The amount of health drops is so good. Where even is? Okay. We do not get experience drops from these, do we? We get it from charging the artifacts. So otherwise you could farm forever. I actually dig that. Fine. Okay. Well, I mean, we know it's the staff, but we're going to probably forget. But I'm... Excited with this staff choice or staff get? Mana drain. 
Okay, so yeah, mana's going down over time. Gotcha. I wonder if we do mana drain if it still happens. Or, uh, sorry, if we do our Q if it still happens. Uh, doesn't look like it. No, yeah, it does. It does. It do, it do, it do. It do, it do, it do. Ooh, 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 ooh. Health drops. Where are them health drops? We get extra drops. Where's the health ones? Don't exist. All right. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. All right. Now, fellas. Good deal. It's Durgoth, the also wise. Oops. Oh, we were actually in range of that. Sad stuff. If we're close enough to hit with all of them, we do the right click. That's just the facts. Oh boy. Okay, so yeah, it still does five. So I don't know what that other stuff was all about. I don't know, we must have taken damage from something else in the meantime. We can, whoop, poison him and then switch to something else. Oh, that's some damage. Oh, oh my God. This gun, it's crazy. There's no point to do this, is there? Uh, maybe there's something that will help us with the mana progress. Or mana progress? Sure. We should be done, though, right? I, I guess I didn't double check that it said final floor, but it's either that or we went to the wrong place. Alright, we're good, we're good, we're good. We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Hopefully, I think we probably got like 20 coins or something, didn't we? Yeah, wow, <laughs> son of a gun! Incinerator. Okay. Okay. I'll admit. Oh, there's also a button to skip these. Asiro's shield is a. What is that? Dragon's biomastery level up. Must have been an amulet, right? So Jacob did not level up, but I think we can upgrade him. We can upgrade him, right? No. Okay. Okay. Rip. Rip, 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 rip. I, I mean, I want to, I want to play as Jacob though. Let's see, what do you got? Short range fire attack. Okay, that is cool. It's cool. I didn't realize that the second, that the new wands would actually be so interesting. That changes, that changes my mind about a couple things. All right, we'll do it. If it's a if if it's given to us as an option, we'll do it. But I kind of want to either what is this? Uh, drops a shield in front of you. Oh, that's pretty cool. I'll unlock an extra charge into uh, that because I really really enjoy that. I think that'll be a very good one for us. Unlocks. Oh, it actually tell you. Look at that. It actually tells you it's a character now. Um. Weapon wand, wand amulet, staff. I feel like we have a lot of other stuff. I feel like I'm curious. Two perks. All right. All right. Jacob, incinerator, Amazon, amulet, and skull of Xanatos. I wish we had the other gun that increased our fire damage across the board, because then our then our incinerator would actually be leveled up as well. So this is a little bit concerning for early game, since our wand is going to be significantly weaker. Like, quite a bit weaker. But I'm excited. Phoenix Crypt. Let's check it. This one is sick. Okay. I like design wise. I love it. How strong is it? You know, it remains to be seen, but I love it. We're not going to go and do a challenge room literally immediately. 
Well, maybe we're gonna do a challenge room literally immediately, and then we will just um. <laughs> and then what? We'll just uh, we'll just restart if if it's bad. I'm actually fine with that. Where's the stupid chest? Where's this chest? There it is. It's on this side. Okay. All right. Please, no fire enemies. God, it's so cool. So we can actually set the enemy on fire with this. Like, the burn effect. That's... That's some stuff. So these guys are gonna... Oh. I was gonna say they're gonna be fire immune or something. Or strong against fire. It's fine. Nothing else we can do there, though. Oops. Why did I do that? Nobody knows. Why can't we use our Q? Though those guys, uh, their explosion radius or explosion damage, I can't remember which, uh, got nerfed, which I am all about. Nasty wave. Nasty wave. I keep on stepping on the fire because I'm trying to make sure I get all of these stupid crystals. Okay. Next wave. We're actually doing just fine. Okay. Good enough for me. Is this piercing? God dang <laughs> These fire traps. Doing such a bad job. Come here, come here, come here. There we go. That was rough. That was bad, but, you know, we did it. Get a new alchemy weapon if you already have one. Nope, we don't. Give me a frost bow. Okay. I'm pretty neutral on the frost bow at this moment. What am I? Eh, and by that I mean... I don't like it very much. It's one of my least favorites. Uh, Dragon Vial. It might be a good idea. Let's let's check some. What's the passive? Picking up some spell mana. You get some spell mana while picking up experience. I mean, that's really good. Uh, let's let's get the Dragon's Vial so we can spread out our uh, our types of damage. In addition to, you know, we will actually be able to level this up instead, I think is a good idea. Just because, I don't know, I like the thought of having experience in all, a lot of this stuff. Also, it seems like if, if we have something where, like, the biggest weak weakness of it is the fact that it's... Whoa. The fact that it's uh, got bad mana economy, then I feel like that's a really good weapon for us to have with this setup. Does that sound mean we're doing critical hit damage? Because of, like, typing. I think it may. Did we get everything? Alright, alright. Fire rate in one man. It seems like it's a pretty decent mana economy one. I really want to know if this pierces it. And I don't... I can't tell. I don't think it does. Oh! See, it would make sense if we were critting with that, because he's an ice boy. Now... It makes a sound there, too. These guys would be poison. Yeah, I really don't know, man. I think that it might make a slightly different sound based off of if it's a uh, critical hit or not. See, like, that does not sound like a... Oops, like a st strong hit. That It definitely doesn't. I'm a... Oh boy, I'm getting toasted. Because I'm just trying to do some science here. Is that so bad? 
We have the freaking Amazon amulet. I grabbed the wrong one. <laughs> That's why. All right. Well, tis what tis. We'll, I'm sure we'll get a staff. Amazon amulet is really good too, though. So. I can't tell if there's a sound effect thing. Like, that sounds a little bit, just like a little bit different. Let's get stupid. Let's get stupid. 25% max HP penalty for a significant damage up. I don't know. Should we do it? No. No, we shouldn't. Did I do it? I already did. You know the answer. Yikes. I was hoping it would be better. Kind of have to assume what the shots behind us are going to look like. Uh. Sir, get poisoned, sir. I would think that that would do nothing. It definitely, it makes sense that it doesn't freeze at the very least. You'd think fire would be the best for that, and they definitely they they melt, but they're also weak HP enemies. Is this more likely to set on fire the right click? The hell, man? Ah! Okay. Could be a thing where there's also, like, there's damage fall off or something. That'd be an interesting thing to know. Based off of, like, your distance. Whoop. Oh boy. All right, you know what? We're going for it. Infinite mana for a little bit here. Now we're low. Get back through. Get back through, Master Key Choir. Oh. Nice. Oh, that was clean. All right. Hell yeah. A little bit of health back in the start of every fight sounds like a nice way to oh my God. take the RNG out of uh, survivability just a little bit. Which is, in my opinion, always going to be good. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, what the hell? Ooh, fewer fewer enemies spawn. I mean, it's a it's a tough one. Cause really, I got caught on fire by that dash jumping and dashing over it, and I still got caught on fire. It's weird. Uh, if your enemies spawning, I don't know if it's good. I don't know if it's good. I also like because it means it's less experience unless they make it so you also get an experience buff. It seems like a bad thing to take. Am I wrong? Bring it. Okay. Get him. Got him. Oh. No, you that's a friendly you can friendly fire with that. Lesson learned, man. He has a new attack? He has an actually new attack. What the heck? Oops. What the hell? Wouldn't have expected. Okay, so it was it was this. I'll admit I'm liking this weapon more. This run. I'm noticing it feel better. So that helps.
we were unfortunately just a little bit shy from being at 69% accuracy. Which, as we all know, is the ideal accuracy. So yeah, a one length, we had a 1 out of 5 length and a 2 out of 5 length, and they were both two floors. You can't explain that. Just want to pick it up, but let's get back to this. Well, hello, Key. The whole key system doesn't matter too much as a, uh, a, a boy who is going to fully expli explain, uh, <laughs> explain the floor regardless. Game explain. There is no reason not to be excited about that. Whoop. All right. Ooh. It it do be chunkin' though. Oh my god, I forgot we can do friendly fire. I literally just I literally just learned it and I literally just forgot it. Oh boy. This is a large amount of enemies. I would like a staff. Since we have such a wonderful staff amulet. It would just be nice, you know. Poison beats curse? Question mark. Poison potentially beats curse. Curse would beat what then? Or maybe they're just good against each other. Look at my my wand shots fly upward. It's freaking reverse gravity. Oh, that's cool looking, though. In theory, these guys are strong to ice. Oh, wait, no. These are not the ice guys. They are... I don't know what kind of damage they do. Light? Light? Yeah, that definitely... That is a different noise than that one. This sounds like neutral damage. This one. And the poison on poison sounded like the opposite. <laughs> Like, that seems like bad damage. Oh. This, yeah, this seems like, this sounds like neutral to me. Like it's trying to say, this is doing normal damage. That seems like it's doing bad damage, just based off of the sound. I'm just trying to piece that part of the game together here. We'll look at, what the ever live in hell? We'll look at the uh, the monster manual thing at some point here. Yeah. Oh, I thought that we dodged that by like standing perfectly in the middle as it flies by, like those uh, those binding of Isaac uh, host enemies that do that. Okay. I mean, if we're not going to get a staff. Falcon Wings is the speed and dodge thing, so it might be a really good thing to have on... Uh, oh, no, no, no. To have on... That's definitely a different sound. That's doing more damage. Uh, while we have our other thing going, our Q and our mouse button 5 at the same time. I don't know what we call it. Our, our actual, like character spell and the fact that it would make so much sense if this did bonus damage to these guys because they're frost they're the frost ones he's gonna explode oh what any what bring back the ability to jump over that attack like the first game it was so it's such a fun mechanic to be able to j literally uh jump over it because it was a ground ground slam oops this is not the weapon to use for them Not a bad one for these guys. I'm trying to get him set on fire. The other, the bigger boy. Oh no. 
Oh no. Who else is over here? Nope, nobody. This is just the trapper stuff. Oh god, it's bad. Die, 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 die. die. Thank you. Phew. God, look at that. <laughs> look at it fly up. It's super cool. kind of want to aim at their toes. That's really weird and I love it. It's a unique kind of you need to be close to the enemy. Oh, jeez, oh, sorry about that. I just, everything, my keyboard slipped. Oh, all right. We got a couple rooms yet. I'll say that the difficulty feels nice enough. Like, I, I like where it's at. Not Well, it's only nine. Woo. Woo, ba oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, baby, that was worth it. 46 coins for such a short mission. Even if we die now, this is stonks. Oh, I thought I was gonna get shot there. Is this the one we like? No, this is, I mean, yes, but. Yes, but also no. Uh, I mean, I actually take the falcon wings. I feel like getting a little bit of uh, safety could do us some good. Since we are we're going a little a little glass cannony. Enhanced dodge. Oh. Oh cool. Cool, but also at what cost? Oh, alright. It's a, at, at a movement speed cost, I feel... Oh, okay, so we do not... <laughs> confirmed right there that we have no iframes on dodge. I didn't think we did, but, like... I always thought there was hope, you know? I thought there was hope. Arcane. Oh... Yeah, we're moving slower. We, we need to be dodging basically everywhere, which is... That's the trade-off. I wish you told me that. We also switched back to the Mana Stone, didn't we? Yep. Yeah, I'll take it, you know. We could use up the mana stone and then switch back. It's a very real possibility and potentially good idea. I want to see super uh, fast fire rate with this. Like, just amazingly fast. Lights out. Brace the darkness. Oh, it's, you know, it's not as bad as uh, some other games. Honestly, it almost makes the enemies easier to spot. Because they have some, like, inherent glow to them. Fire rate up is definitely uh, making us go through our, our ammo a little bit quicker. Our, our mana a little bit quicker to the point where we actually do run out pretty noticeably fast with this. Yeah. I don't know. I just really want to get that bad boy upgraded. Oh, hi. Where did this barrier come from? Was it the... Um, it must have been from our perk.
Final room, I think, maybe? Final room. Yeah, we should definitely, we should use up this mana stone. Use up the mana stone like crazy. Oh my god. Well, okay, fine. It doesn't make sense to use up the mana on these guys with that frost move. Don't make sense. Nope. Well. Yep. Trying to use some... Ah! I was trying to use what was left of that spell book, but I guess we already did. I'll admit, I want to see what this is like. Oh, that's pretty cool. Oh my god, that's good. I really like that, actually. Here I was thinking that maybe it'd be a stupid idea, but no, just get a wand that's really mana hungry. And then, boom, infinite fire. I bet you there's a wand that is, like, so strong. Like, a, I bet you there's, like, a sniper rifle wand. It uses, like, all of your energy. But it's so strong. And I feel like that could be a very fun little combo to play with. That being said, I'm just like, I love, I love the Jacob character. He's good. He's a good boy. Where the hell was this? Oh, God. Where did we get it? Because it was a perk. Oh, man. Where was that amulet? I don't remember. I don't know. I don't remember. Because it was from a perk, so it's just on the ground somewhere. I'm not going to go looking for it. They should... There should 100,000% be a little marker on the mini-map. Where that stuff is. Alright, who's it going to be? Alright. Maybe we could... Just, I would kind of want to just see what the wand's like. Took, I just took it. Yeah, it's, it's pretty good. Oh my god. Definitely don't want to. Well, definitely is a strong word because it's still does good damage. I feel like we finally like cracked a very big part of the game that they kind of should have made more clear. Oof. Ah, ah, ah. This is a good wand for aerial enemies since it does have the, f the, uh, or at the very least, it's, it doesn't have the same penalty that it has for some grounded enemies. With the fact that it is, uh, gonna be, like, kind of flying slowly upwards. No, you jerk! You jerk! I'm so- Oh my god! Are you kidding me? That freeze wombo combo. Disgusting. Disgusting. Also, that follows me? Kill you with a frost bow. How does that make you feel, frost bull? Where's the experience, Chris? I mean, we don't need it, but like... Feels like the EXP I got was really low. Alas, that was a very fruitful run. Very, very pleased with what we got there. Oh, so good. Probably got like a, what, 60 something? What? Oh, is that, I mean, but we got the double. Magnus Rifle. Nice. Bloodlust, that sounds good. Stone skin sounds good. Wait, in fact, I, I think I remember stone skin and it being very good. 51. Yes. 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 We'll get that level up there. 
A little extra mana for what it's worth. I definitely want to upgrade the incinerator. Sounds like a fun time. What's the passive here? Lower mana usage for all attacks. Oh, holy moly. That's good. That's good. Oops. Oh, I thought it was already at level two. More spell mana for mana crystals, of course. I, yeah, I, I dig all that stuff. I dig it all. We need to level that up again before we can get the 20% damage upgrade. Defeating an enemy may drop a mana crystal. I mean, that's good. That's really good. Can't deny. Cannot deny. Cannot deny. I like that upgrade. I kind of want to just sit on my 19 here so that we can like upgrade Jacob and the wand again because I, I'm really, as much as like, you know, I, I love this wand. It was great. But this, uh, this wand is so cool looking. It feels pretty strong and it's definitely, it's different. It's different. Uh, the visuals on it are really slick as well. It, it makes me more excited. Like, this whole time I've kind of been like, eh, I don't know. I don't really want to go for the wands. I don't want to go for the wands. But now I'm interested. Now I'm like, hey, maybe I should be going for the wands. Because <laughs> that one was really cool. And if they can get if they get any bit weirder than that, more unique than that, then I'm super on board. But I'm going to hold on to my coins for now and then put them into places where I really, really uh, want to have upgraded in the future. Unless I, maybe there's like, maybe there's a passive we can unlock somewhere. Uh, Twilight, we already have that passive. Additional mana for crystals. Any of these at level one already? No. All right, but that is gonna do it here for today. I am going to check out the library. Carrots, vulnerabilities poison. So they are extra vulnerable. Do they have resistance to curse? Okay, resistant to curse. Vulnerable to poison. Resistant to fire. Vulnerable to ice. Resistant to curse. Vulnerable to poison. I This whole time, I, I I really... Yeah. I wish this was a little more obvious, I guess. Resistant to basic. Like, basic wand? Wow. This whole time. Uh, vulnerable to ice. No resistances, though. Resistant to lightning. Okay, th th this is this is fascinating. Definitely fascinating. Hollow warrior, resistant to poison, po poison, poison. Oh, I'm all I see. I thought this was a fire, a fire enemy, but you know. All right. Defeat that enemy twenty-two more times. So these guys don't have vulnerabilities or anything. Gotcha. Spawns fifteen. Uh, what? That isn't like that's how many times we've seen them. All right. Well, that is going to end up doing it here for today. I kind of want to see if we could maybe find out what the things we just got were. Uh, stone skin. Yep. There we go. Stone skin in the first game was a must have. So I'm very excited. Cover some health. When there we go. Oh, my God. We just unlocked two of my core perks from the original game that I, uh, I totally forgot about. Just straight up flat damage resistance and healing from XP gems. It was so crucial in the first game. So I'm so excited that those are back. That is going to do it here for today, though. Oh, my goodness. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the like button. It doesn't take any time. And it helps this uh, rank higher in search results and recommendeds and keep the series around for many episodes to come if you want to do so. And hey, subscribe if you want Rogue likes some more every single day. This is going to be coming out at 11, yeah, 11 a.m. Central every single day, as long as you guys continue to support the series. So thank you, thank you, and I will see you next time. Bye.